Is it working? I hope so. <laughs> we always, uh, always run into whatever kind of troubles here. But it's not quite 8 o'clock yet, right? I still got time to take my, my sip of coffee. We were just testing. About five minutes ago, there was no internet in the house. And EJ, EJ did something and it started working. All right, is it not eight o'clock yet? It is 7.59. 7.59. Well, yes. Yes, there it is. <laughs> Say hi to Dan Healy. Hello, Dan Healy, here we go. And my cousin Jerry. Jerry, good. We got that's that's all I need to start here. I know that's it's sort of a you know it's sort of the litmus test of you know is life still going on. So I don't know if you guys had read my post earlier on in the day or any of you who are on right now. Um, just realizing that I hardly ever do do uh, too much of my own stuff, and so um, I've been beating the hell out of a lot of different songs here for the last year couple of years I'm gonna throw in some uh, some more originals here tonight and uh, I'm gonna start with the plowman's road sort of one of the more recent songs I wrote um, I got my my plow parked out front of the house um, waiting for that phone call around two or three in the morning to, to head out and plow the roads in Concord I hope doesn't matter now because they already gave us the day off from school but uh, um, I wrote this song, started this song one night when I was out plowing, um, just going down through all the different streets in Concord and realized every street had a, had a, an awful lot of memories. So I came up with this song, it's called The Plowman's Road. This ain't a town for no losers. This town ain't no town for old clowns Hey, this town is just a town for pick and choosers Yeah, born here and left to hang around I am a plowman in my hometown I clear the roads come every snow Every street tells me some old story hey, of everyone I ever seem to know. Yet pick up Joan Willie on Brister's Hill and Lana and Muskie off Route 2 and Watts and Hardy by the old mill. It just seemed like the natural thing to do Well, Thwaites his Mustang squealing hell down Main Street And Damon's fury clunking through the ball Genie's cutlass idling at great meadows Making hearts and windows in the fall and I had other friends for other reasons There ain't nothing much about us much the same They would live in the space between the seasons They're rising from the swamp on Hawthorne Lane I am a plowman in my hometown I clear the roads come every snow and every street tells me some old story hey, of everyone I ever seem to know and sometimes 
Lyle of my old home At the corner of Paul Revere Road Christ the house is twice as big as it once was And the story's twice as long as now they're told Yeah, the streets in the night are empty meadows And my trucks a lonely plow upon the field And the headlamps disappear in distant shadows And my blade's the only sound that I can feel For the song's too damn long to have an ending and there ain't no final page to turn and close As these roads that I plow are long and bending How the hell can anyone know? This ain't a town for no losers This town ain't no town for old clowns Hey, this town's just a town for pick and choosers. Hey, born and left to hang around. I am a plowman in my hometown. I clear the roads come every snow and every street. Tells me some old story Of everyone I ever seem to know And every street Tells me some old story Of everyone I ever seem to know Oh really? Oh good. He had both asked for that song. Oh really? The yeah. Plowman's Road. Yeah, and then, uh, it, Ashley. It just seems it does. They, they asked for it like before you right as you were. Playing. Oh okay. Um, there you, go. you know. Um, David McGuire is not here. Don't tell Jack. Okay. <laughs> okay, David, you're not here. Well, David, I'll be plowing right by your right by your house because. Uh, Jack, Jack said he and David are both there. The alcohol, you know, look for me. I'll be, I'll, I'll, bring, I'll be out there around four in the morning, you know, dying for a cup of coffee. I usually go. It takes me about three times around your, uh, around your block. I'm always pissing off some, somebody out there because they, they just get out there. They get their whole driveway shoveled, and I come by. Um, <laughs> Krista Wallace is tuning in from Florida. Jeez, Krista, you're like the what's the word? Peripatetic. Oh, me like <laughs> peripatetic. They go there everywhere. It's like that old old uh, Johnny Cash. Line. I've been everywhere, man. Um, Emilio is wondering where Hat Rack is. Hat Rack's not feeling great tonight. And uh, no, he tested fine. Say hi to neighbor Dave. Oh, neighbor Dave, here we go. Dave's been a good, a good, a uh, great support system for me for the uh my my old songs and well dave this is one of my one of my very oldest songs see you charlie um it's a song called dream i don't know if rogue is on or not but rogue and i were inveterate hanger outers you know and we never we never had much money and this, i wrote the song back in the days when people we used to balance their checkbooks you know occasionally and uh so one night, Rogue and I had a little contest to see who could uh, balance their checkbook the fastest. And well, he went out and got a 12-pack of beer, and I wrote a song, so I don't think we ever, ended, ever, ever actually balanced our checkbooks, and I don't think I ever have since. But um, you have a wife for that. I have a wife. That's very right. I do. I do have a wife for that. I never. Have, I have no clue. So Jennifer Brock. Oh, hey, Jennifer. You're my best to say, man. I miss him around the old classroom. Um, David said they'll give you coffee if you ring their bell. Okay, I'll do that. 
Give me the, what's the what's the number of their house? I gotta know the number. Well, the song is called Dream anyway. I know. Hey, when the money don't come like you thought so before that it might do And things pile on things you don't seem to get done what you'd like to Yeah, things pile on things, pile on things, pile on things Piling on Well, you work, you get paid, you come home, you say, hey, babe, hey, I love you. Well, you work, you get paid, you come home, you say, hey, babe, what can we do? Oh, we can dream, we can dream. Dream, we can dream what we want to. We can dream, we can dream, we can dream all day. But you won't. And the money don't come like it thought so before that it might do. You got your blue cross and your blue shield and your car loan the Brent's too. Hey, now you're blue. And I know sushi won't kill me, but it hurts when they bill me. Hey, for off. And the mailman brings my bill, you swear to God, you know nobody. In a while Well, the money don't come And the things don't get done You work, you get paid You come home, you say Babe, hey, I love you But the money don't come Like you thought so before That it might so I dream and I dream and I dream and I dream what I want And you can dream, you can dream, you can dream, you can dream what you want So let's dream, baby, dream, baby, dream, baby, dream, baby, dream Yeah, it's an old one, huh? Remember you played that for me when I left Acton and went to St. Peter's? Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah. Took a huge pay cut. Take a, you took a huge pay cut. I mean, that's Rogue, Rogue is saying, how about the telephone pole song? And Dave Brainerd wants to know what the telephone pole song is. <laughs> Come on, let's go. <laughs> this is... I like it. Oh, my God, I totally... You know, it's funny. I, can, I know the beginning. I just put out this whole book of my songs... You can find it on Amazon, but uh, shitload of songs, and I totally forgot about the telephone pole song. It doesn't need to be written down, right, Rogue? <laughs> this is this is probably the reason why I am as uh, unknown as I am. <laughs> well, I am just a telephone pole stuck inside a dirty hole. Wires hanging off of me. I wish I was a evergreen tree <laughs> and if i could i surely would be a cord of firewood look up me up and light your fire throw me all your sinning liars but i am just a telephone pole stuck inside a dirty hole wires hanging off of me i wish i was an evergreen tree I totally, totally, totally forgot about that song. 
Um, so many of my songs I, I wrote, um, my early songs, you know, I, I could hardly play the guitar, and I was just working, working around Concord and flunking out of college and doing all those things that have sort of defined my life. At a, at a certain point, uh, I started right after high school, right after about a half a semester of college, I went back and started working for Jack Madison over at uh, Madison's Dairy Farm, which was just through the woods from my house. And, and then uh, Jack let me, uh, let us live in one of the old, uh, old milkers' houses later on, me and Sandy and Dan. And, uh, I got the other guy, he was Bill. <laughs> he was some crazy guy. But we had, we had goats and chickens, or I had goats and chickens. And, um, so I wrote this song called Living in the Barnyard. Some days ain't good for anything, some days are just a ball. If you don't mind living in a barnyard, you won't mind living at all. When your yapping dog is gonna treat a coon, you gotta get up out of bed. And if you don't mind living in the barnyard, you won't mind living at all. So open up the rusty door, the sun will warm the floor. Spread yourself in the drying hay, out of the blind bear's way. Shoot the shit, chew the bit. It's a suey mooey lucky ducky chicken clicky crack a day. When you tear your back on the barbed wire, you can only bend so low. Then if you don't mind living in the barnyard, you won't mind living at all. Yeah, your yapping dog's gonna treat a coon, you gotta get up out of bed. And if you don't mind living in the barnyard, you won't mind living at all. They'll open up the rusty door, the sun will warm the floor. Spread yourself in the drying hay, out of the blind mare's way. Shoot the shit, chew the bit. It's a sewer move with luck, a duck, a chicken, click a crack a day. It's a suey mooey lucky ducky chicky clickly crack Oh day <laughs> No Milo doesn't approve Milo Milo's trying to escape. Um It's a. Uh, it's kinda of fun to go down memory lane these these songs. I mean these these are all songs that um I I really never ever performed that much. Um Wade said that the telephone pole has now gone viral in the Wade household. <laughs> we well, have a nice day off tomorrow, okay, to uh, have fun with it. Oh, Milo's got to go. Um, I always like this song. It's one of my favorite songs that I wrote, you know. Obviously, it's not, a, not, a, not, a, not another dance tune, but uh, like I said, you know, I was, I was no uh, gift to the world of the intelligentsia back in my day. But uh, I worked hard. Um, I could always find a job in Concord working for somebody. And after my uh, stints in college, you know, I'd come back to Concord and work here and there. And my one of my very first jobs was working for Dick Hale over at uh, Shoemaker and Jennings, um, laying down driveways and sidewalks. That's where I, that's where I learned to swear and where I learned to uh, drink coffee. Um, and then at night I'd go meet, you know, Muskie and Lana and Mendy and, um, and Steve Monero and all the boys, at, you know, down at the, uh, at Ho Joe's or the Elks or something like that. And they'd be drinking and telling stories and I'd be drinking and writing songs on napkins and it was kind of cool because, um, I really sucked as, you know, a writer, and, but it was really cool that my friends kind of, you know, Seem to put up with me. But this song is called Halfway to Boston. Every so often I felt like the need to get out of Concord and, and try to figure out who the heck I really was. I can remember the first line. 
What does that song start? Well, not rain. Let's see. Yeah, rain's falling outside the box. Rain's falling. No, no, that's not how it goes. Sorry. That's the other song. I didn't write it. <laughs> Oh, let me hold on here. Let me see. I got it. I got it in the in the book here. On Kindle. Let me see if it goes. This is sort of embarrassing. It's like one of my very first songs. Songs in the book. Uh, something about ride out playground. Oh, I should be down until I'm playing softball now. Now I didn't know what to do it. <laughs> I should be down with Tom playing softball now at the right of playground. My beer money's in four cases if we win, but I ain't hanging around. Cause I'm halfway to Boston, I know But I don't know where I'm going I know I'm up, hey, for leaving Hey, this town and my way's all behind Yes, sometimes, yes, sometimes I gotta go where nobody knows me So sometimes I just go I laid two driveways down And a sidewalk for the town And some lady, she bought ten tons of sand She said, son, just put it all over there And be careful my lawn doesn't tear Yeah, watch out for the rose beds Keep an eye on the wires overhead I said, lady, classics lady well, it's only a goddamn long I'll give you fourteen Four wheels And I'll be gone I met Anne the other night White's born by the firelight She's an old friend of Dan well, too much love is too much pain Too many times the same She cried holding my hand We'll hang our hearts on the tips of the moon And we'll laugh and dance to the loom Hang a hammock on two distant stars only astronomers will know where we are And our eyes, they'll light up the night time And they'll blink, and they'll close and be gone Nothing lost, nothing lonesome, nothing wrong Cambridge, I'll grab the tea I'll let go of some other me I'll let the lights of the city kick in And of all I am, I was today I'd just have stayed and played And hope we'd win it again But I'm halfway to Boston, I know I just don't know where I'm going Hey, I know I'm up, hey, for leaving Hey, this town and my way's all behind Yes, sometimes, yes, sometimes 
I gotta go where nobody knows me So sometimes I just go Oh, the intelligentsia. There we go, Jack. I'm in your club now, if that's the case. I'm the... He said, no denying, and David said, denied. <laughs> hard time tonight. Uh, Rick well, Peterson says the originals are why he comes. Oh, Rick's always been very good, good with a... Uh, good with requesting some of the old songs from uh, Fires in the Belly. Um... My only real stab at producing something. Uh. Maybe a little somewhere north of Bangor from Fires in the Belly. Um, uh, I don't know how many people have, at least in the old days, I don't know if it's changed, but you know, old days be in the 70s and 80s. Um, if you drove up north of Bangor, they, uh, they stopped having towns for quite a while, I mean, and they just gridded off sections to uh, T sections and R sections. And, and uh, one night we're hanging out in my cabin in Carlisle with a bunch of my buddies, and I had I had two outlets in my house, and you know one of the outlets was powering a little little TV my mother had bought me to stay in touch with humanity. And, um, we were watching some Sunday night movie, and they're getting all pissed off at me because I kept predicting what was going to happen. I think Darby or somebody said, you know, go write your own frigging Sunday night movie tonight. So I wrote this song about a guy who kills somebody down south and tries to tries to hide in the woods of Maine. It's called Somewhere North the Banger. Well, somewhere north the bank, on the run from Tennessee. Well, lost in basket paper line, section TR3. Well, it's hit him is an outlaw, Georgia Cracker son, who left on Sunday morning with his daddy's favorite gun. It hit him with the loneliness of wondering where you are. On a long ago railway stretch between the stars Yeah, wondering how long until some logger finds a car Well, two weeks shy of 19, 1992 She got tickets with her girlfriend for that new man coming through she got tickets for the show, she said to have a night on town I'll meet you in the morning at Franny's Coffee Ground She met the backstage roadie of a traveling country band Now it's hard to slow the pain that grows inside a hurting man I took one of Joe's old Rugers and the lawn to my head Yeah, I borrowed Lance's Mustang and a mobile credit card Drove every pothole back road that got in Arkansas Hey, by now there was an all points on a Georgia crack of sun Who left on Sunday morning with his daddy's favorite gun and I heard the church bells ringing, bleeding, pulling on my soul. I almost turned back, I couldn't bear to go. Well, 20 years of praying, doing what I was told. Well, they played three shows in Nashville, Johnson City, for a night. There are two airbrushed old greyhounds under marquee neon light Well I followed them to every show until I found the man With a tattoo of Geronimo on the back of his right hand 
And I asked him about a gal he met at Saturday night show She says, you get kind of rough and don't understand no Yeah, I thought that I'd find out myself just if that be so Says it like to think you lead your life out on the air And she says the way we live our lives we may as well be dead Hey, but now that you believe that you're the God's only son you Gotta walk a higher road than any other man And you gotta tow a higher line and somehow make it real and you gotta learn in disregard to think hard as you feel But he pulled his knife, took his life, pay for what you steal I'm somewhere north of Bangor on the run from Tennessee We're lost in Basque paper land in section TR3 Ain't no more an outlaw than a Georgia cracker son You will not play the renegade trapped on the run And you love the strange loneliness of knowing who you are and you love the way the patterns lay stretched between the stars And you know that when they find you They won't know who you are Oh yeah, yes, um, that's right. You were a maritime man. My brother Tommy went to. Uh, he was the only Fitzsimmons not to go to UMass in two generations. Yep. Um, Jack must love your originals. He's asking for the band played Waltzing Matilda. <laughs> Um, well, here, I'll stick with an original, and I'll do one, one, one more here, for just to see. Say hi, Seth. Oh, Seth is on. There you go. Seth is the, uh, the maestro who made a lot of the, all, especially in Fires in the Belly, made them go from being whatever the heck they were to actual songs. So if you do, if you ever do pick up, um, go on to Spotify or Apple Music. They have they have fires in the belly, and you can you can hear Seth. I think Seth literally played fourteen or fifteen different instruments on the album. You know, and he'd run behind the booth, press a button, run out there and start playing bass, and he'd run back, press another button, go out there playing guitar, and run out, and press another button, he'd be on the piano. You know, even the drums. But this is a song called uh, Lying in the Sand. And I wrote it back right when the first Gulf War was starting, Jack. And uh, I had been coaching coaching some wrestling and got a, a message from one of my uh, wrestlers who was heading, heading over there to fight in Iraq. He had joined the Marines after high school. And he said he had no idea what Iraq was. He said he thought it was, he thought, he thought Kuwait was a was a fruit, but George Bush got up there and said that you know he's going to draw a line in the sand. And if they cross that line, then you know whatever the hell. But they crossed the line, and we had the Gulf War. I'm trying to smile in the belly. I'm doing the best that I can. Here I'll flying over to find out 
where they've drawn that line in the sand There's something strange about gold With shackles with just singing a song Well I feel kinda wide but I guess he's just tired Can't believe this flood is so long And roll aside of your belly You spill all your fighting grunts out Then me I'm mostly just wondering What this desert war is all about We were lucky on Friday We had a chance to shoot pool One last pass for a night We were sitting up racks Slapping each other's backs This time we might get to fight Yeah, we might get a chance Hell to blow off some fans Do what they trained us to do But here on the plane It don't seem the same Now that it's all coming true Then roll us out of your belly Fill all your fighting grunts out Me, I'm mostly just wondering What this desert war is all about Well, I called everyone I could think of My little nephew kept asking me why Mom and Dad both come down to a motel in town to wish their youngest goodbye. Well, I told them all to quit worrying. They will all be coming back soon. I didn't mention my sister had told me she found my dad crying alone in his room. Then roll aside of your belly. You spit all your fighting grunts out. I'm mostly just wondering what this desert war is all about. Here yeah, we're grunts and we're finally airborne. Ackles is singing a song. What I don't know, it's kind of quiet and slow, but everyone's tapping along. Singing a roll aside of your belly You spill all your fighting grunts out Me, I'm mostly just wondering What this desert war is all about You roll aside of your belly Spill all your fighting grunts out Me, I'm mostly just wondering But that desert pours all Ed yeah, you know. You know that you said the same thing to your kids. Oh, I know. Yeah, um, yeah. You and my, you and my dad. Rick was like another, another, another son to my my dad. My beautiful thing about my fire, my father. Like we called him the fiery EJ. I said, uh, he treated everybody the same. It didn't matter who came to the house. You know, you know, he was gonna scream at somebody. He'd scream at scream at my friend as quickly as me. And then uh, love them just as quickly too. How about Diesel Lullaby? Oh, Russ Turnquist. Russ is another inspiration to me. Oh, Kim, thanks for coming on. It's a uh, very poignant that Mike is, is stepping down from a. Being the high school football coach um, after a couple of generations of Roba shows. I'm going to dedicate this song to Jack Madison, who passed, passed kind of recently. 
This is a song that um, Denise and I co-wrote. It's called uh, Diesel Lullaby. Denise used to love when we were driving around in our old 1970s camper bus, you know, with a big diesel engine, and all seven kids would be splayed out across the bathtubs and bunks and floors and, you know, countertops, you know, and we'd be driving around, driving around wherever we were going, and um, we just love the sound of that old cat diesel in there. And one day we're, one day we're talking about um, how many people around the world, you know, the sound of a diesel is like this, this uh, beautiful, beautiful reminder that somebody you love is returning back into your life. A song called uh, Diesel Lullaby. Dedicating it to Jack, because Jack uh, was the first one that taught me that uh, how diesel engines worked, you know, on the tractors. And so I threw him into the song. That's just a little guy sitting on Grandpa's lap, riding the tractor before taking a nap. Well, Gramps bought that farm all back in the day When he said that it lived on heartbreaking hay Heartbreaking hay and turnips and corn And an old diesel tractor, hands rough and warm He didn't ask much and he never asked why when he died, we sang a diesel lullaby. Well, a diesel lullaby makes you love and makes you cry. Says hello and says goodbye when you're alone. In the field or on the plow, or the road you're traveling now, that diesel lullaby will always bring you home Dad got the fire when Gramps passed away He traded his toolbox for heartbreaking hay And Mom, she got a job at the diner downtown Yeah, she made more in tips then we grew from the ground So dad traded ten acres to change up his luck He swapped for Jack Madison's freight liner truck And then long nights I'd stare at a hole in the sky And listen for the sound that diesel lullaby Yeah, the diesel lullaby Makes you love and makes you cry Says hello and says goodbye when you're alone In the field or on the plow Or the road you're traveling now This diesel lullaby will bring you home I was 15 years old Dad lost the farm He rolled the freight liner And shattered his arm Well, Dad lived on oxy Mom lived in pain And I just played the same songs Again and again now I'm a fancy guitar picker in a traveling country band My bunk's on a bus riding through the heartland And I hope my girls and my boys are staring at the sky Cause daddy's coming home in his diesel lullaby 
Well, the diesel lullaby makes you love and makes you cry. Says hello and says goodbye when you're alone. In the field or on the plow, the road you're traveling now, this diesel lullaby will always bring you home. I like that song. Mm. Do another one from uh, Fires in the Belly here. No, I'll do one from Looking for the Light. Russ loves that one too. Hmm? Oh, good. Thanks. It's a, it's a little bit like a... Oh, hey to Karen Florio. Hey, Karen. How are you? Back traveling. Back I know. They're always traveling. Do they, they have another dog? Did they buy another dog? No. Oh. Two is enough. Trixie's enough, right? Well, a couple of years ago, two summers ago, I started uh, trying to go in a different direction with my song right now. I was just... I was probably inspired by my, my Pete Caiaphas over here with this, this book, The Way West, you know. Really cool book. And uh, I started writing less and less from my own, my own life and started imagining myself in somebody else's life. Um, so I wrote a whole bunch of songs. They, they ended up being a group of songs called uh, um, Looking for the Light. Here's, here's, here's the song, Looking for the Light. As a poor boy, western Texas, dig for and sketchy ground, I went home, a barrel shorter, bucket wiser for what I found. And we got time to make things right. You gotta run like a child looking for the light Well, I found God with a Waco preacher He showed to me my deadly sin I went home with my salvation Then I lost it all again And you got time to make things right you gotta run like a child looking for the light. I got a wife who swore she loved me. Got a bottle that loved me more. Two darling children, remember daddy. There's just some ghost outside the door. And we got time to make things right. You gotta run like a child looking for the light I'm going home, a weary hobo I can't undo what I have done This bag of bones is just my body A restless soul's race is run And we got time to make things right you gotta run like a child looking for the light So make today be my tomorrow Make your life be straight and true Eat my sins and endless sorrow And just do what you should do Cause we got time to make things right you gotta run like a child looking for the light And we got time to make things right You gotta run like a child looking for the light Um, well Russell if you're still on, Russell's, Russell's been a 
big inspiration to me, and he's he's the one that turned me on to uh, Blaze Foley. I mean, a lot of people have mentioned him over the years, and um, started listening to his music, and it's just like kind of kind of started to infuse fuse itself to me as kind of very stark uh, songs where it doesn't seem like there's a lot of light but there's a lot of depth and so um, I guess thinking of thinking of him I I wrote this song here it's called uh, originally I had it love will always make you change your mind but it, you know takes up the whole table of contents so <laughs> now I've been calling it Portland Harbor but I wrote it uh, on a weekend that Denise and I went to uh, Portland Harbor up in Portland um, went to Tyler and Savannah's wedding out on some island in, in Casco Bay it was pretty cool we got back we spent we stayed up a little too late in the old uh, old Port Road area <laughs> Well, the sun rose slow over Macris Island. Well, another night on the old port road, drinking whiskey with my old mate's lady. Yeah, both of us too tired to be alone. But a buddy's wife is a sacred scripture. But the sea is wide and the trip is long. He jumps ship in some Asian harbor. Now nothing's right when everything is wrong. But love is the fickle daughter of a raging fury from the edge of time. It comes and goes like eastern waters. Hey, love will always make you change your mind. Wife took off with a landlocked farmer. Yeah, she took my kid and that old dog too. Now they live up north in a rooster county. Yeah, potatoes is all a new boy knows to do. But he comes home. Most every evening And he comes to bed Most every night He don't dream Of distant shorelines He probably never Lost a girl Or won a fight But love Is a fickle daughter of a raging fury from the edge of time and it comes and goes like eastern waters yeah love will always make you change your mind well next step tide I'll be back on water Loading coal Up Richards Bay Well I might come back Please tell my daughter Late April Or maybe early May Or I might just tramp On a stinking oiler Go anywhere Old sailors go I might come back 
to Portland Harbor. Yeah, maybe, but I guess I never know. Cause love is the fickle daughter of a raging fury from the edge of time. It comes and goes like eastern water. And love will always make you change your mind. Love will always make you change your mind. Mm. Tyler Davis. Oh, is he on? Hopefully, you get on and put that Portland song. Oh, I think it's my best version I've done, Tyler. Because I, I always forget my own lyrics. Say hi to Richard Smith. Oh, hey, Richard. Mister Thoreau. Mm-hmm. Oh, Richard, I got it. We got to get him that book. This is the book I want to send you, Richard. Do do. Bunch of uh, Thoreau-inspired. Thoreau-inspired essays and uh, some stuff about the native peoples and all that kind of stuff. Um, Richard's a really cool guy. He's a, he does does a Thoreau, uh, Thoreau walks and uh, presentations, and uh, now he's the, the in-house scholar over at the Wayside Inn, which is pretty cool. Um, Chris Snell. Oh, Chris Mann. Chris should be from Concord. Chris is like a, an old West Concord person. That's a compliment, Chris. Maybe I should do a little Last of the Boys while... Uh... Oh, Bill. Good. I was psyched he was going to be on. I'm taking advantage of the fact that Hat Rack is not here. I don't even know what key harmonic I... I used to think I was so cool with my harmonica and, you know, my little Bob Dylan imitations. Then I met Hat Rack, and one day he's just like, put that fucking harmonica away. So. But, uh. This is a song I do, probably, it's probably the original song that I do the most. Um, it's called Last of the Boys, and um, I don't think I'm going to use this because I'll screw it up even more. Um, I wrote it one night after I was down down at the Colonial Inn drinking with a bunch of friends back before I was married and everything. And uh, um, Then all of a sudden I realized I was sitting in the bar alone with uh, Howie, the bartender. Everybody remembers Howie. I was like, Howie, I said, where'd everybody go? And remember it like it yesterday, it leans over and just says, Fitz, they got lives. I was like, God damn, so I sat there, had another whiskey or whatever I was having, and, and uh, started writing this song, and then I met Rogue and West Concord at Dino's, and uh, we finished it. But everybody in this song is, is very real, and, um, I was actually just up, up uh, meeting Darby. Rogue was just up from Georgia. Everybody's still alive and well, which is uh, crazy good. And, and uh, Jimmy and Wally have been in touch recently. And that's kind of cool. I made a chorus, and the chorus is simply, hey, you know. I did that so uh, my friends could all sing along, you know. <laughs> I'd have to think too much. Hey, come on over here and I'll buy the next round. Cold beer and some shooters for the boys on the town. Darby ain't drinking, so let's live it up. Does he drive us all home in his company truck? 
In Jesus Christ, Jimmy, can you see that you will? See we drive into Boston in stirrups of hell. Put a cap on the weekend, a stitch in the night. Watch the pass play on Sunday in the welterweight fight. And that's all zero boys, there ain't anymore. That's why we're standing here, that's what it's for. That's why we all go on working all day. Busting our ass for short day. Hey! Trying to get Denise to yell hey on that one. <laughs> well, Wally, there, thanks for the call yesterday. I do need the work, but those people can't be. They're up high in the sky with their heads in the ground. The high talking yahoos that fill up this town. They'll fill up this glass one more time, your old man. Take one for yourself, I know that you can. Nick Van, come here, come on, tell me it's true. You on the college bowl pool and the trifecta too. And that's all zero boys, there ain't anymore. That's why we're standing here, that's what it's for. That's why we all go on working all day, busting our ass for short pay. Hey! Here you go, Rogi. Well, Rogue, what you say? Come on, tell us the one about the dog and the bull and the minister's son. You told it to Willie, you told it to me. You told the whole team down the alley last week. Man, it's hard to believe you've been married since June. Seems just yesterday to go piss at the moon. Piss at the moon, somehow it get by With a pocket of cash and a piece of the sky And that's all zero boys, there ain't anymore That's why we're standing here, that's what it's for That's why we all go on working all day Busting our ass for short pay Hey! But it's hard to believe, quiet of the room, everyone had to be leaving so soon. It seems kind of strange, they got families at home, I'm the last of the boys, I'll have one more alone. Well, one more hour, straight up is fine, I'm okay to drive home, I just take my time, keep all the change. You treated us well I'm just trying to figure If this is heaven or hell Well, heaven or hell For some pit stop for man Where we all just pull over And do what we can You do what you can, man You hope that you're right I'm the last of the boys That's I want on tonight And that's all zero boys There ain't anymore that's why we're standing here, that's what it's for That's why we all go on working all day Busting our ass for short pay Hey! Got a lot of mileage out of that song. Now here I am. <laughs> 30 years later, you know. And uh, writing very different songs. And this is a song I wrote called uh, um, No Dad to Come Home To. Yeah. When I first met Denise, how old Kaylee? She's like two. She was, so she had a little... Uh, Little girl, and you know, then we got fell in love. We got married, and and uh, we had a whole bunch of kids really fast. I think five and five years like that. And 
and uh, came home one day from working, and I was always working late and doing whatever, you know, singing or doing whatever. And uh, Kaylee was upstairs. All the other kids were all excited I was home, and Kaylee was upstairs. And so uh, I wrote this song for her and for Denise. This is another another rain falling down Boston song. I steal I steal lines from myself. Where the rain's falling outside of Boston Thank God I'm not working tonight Got six of my own Stepdaughter at home I got a mama She's keeping things right Well I wonder If they're at the table with their puzzles, their paper and pen And I pull off the highway And I pull in that driveway Where they run to the window again Daddy's home, daddy's home I can hear you Though I'm still Eighteen miles away yeah, This old station wagon's Got a muffler that's dragging But everything's going my way Hey mama, put your head on my shoulder Let me hold you tight to my heart At a long day at home You've been working all alone Everyone's doing their part Well, she says Kaylee is up in her bedroom That she can't really figure out why So I find her upstairs She's in an arm load of bears and she looks at me softly and cries Was I sad with no dad to come home to? And did it hurt? He was so far away Did I sit by the phone Wait for him to come home Like Margaret and EJ today Hey little girl, you can cry on my shoulder But I can't say I know how it feels But if one thing is real, it's this love that I feel And it's one thing nobody can steal You had Nana, you had Papa, you had Mama Yeah, your mom she was with you all day With a ram pickup truck And a boatload of luck He found me and asked me to stay But how about tonight we go dancing through every store in the mall And if the kids don't make scenes We'll have food court cuisine And wind up having a ball Yeah, how about tonight we go dancing Remember, you used to leave the room when I did that. Mm 
Let me see. I realize I, I, realize I have such sad songs, you know. Patrick said some of this stuff sounds far superior without that damn harmonica. <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez, I didn't know Hat Rack was on. <laughs> I didn't even know I had it up there, Hat Rack. Denise must have put it there. You know, I picked it up. It's like this, this, this weird. All oh, I can't play it. Can't play it. Um, let me see. Do I got any good songs? <laughs> Here's a stupid song I wrote when I was uh, traveling around Asia back in the, the, the 18, 1880s, <laughs> the 1980s. And I met this girl at a, at a, uh, at a, what do you call those things, a youth hostel. You know? She was really pretty, she was from France, and I was trying to impress her with my my wit and wisdom, but you know, he didn't seem to care. So I wrote a song called I Am 30, You're 22. It's one of my less intellectual songs. I am 30, you're 22. Is there anything wrong with what I'd like to do with you? You're studying now at the university You're very eloquent on a great diversity You are beautiful Yeah, you Yeah, you You are very, very, very beautiful Well, I rhapsodize on Freud's philosophy But I wish he had to pull me off of you How beautiful And if you knew I wrote songs like this I kinda don't think I'd have got that kiss from you How beautiful Yeah, you Yeah, you you are very, very, very beautiful And you, yeah, you You are very, very, very Another song from Fires in the Belly. Sometimes you just don't know what life's gonna bring to you. You see, I seen your handprints on the wall. So damn afraid it's gonna fall. And you let it go and it didn't move at all. You find life ain't hard, it's just a waterfall You say, hey Who are you to say that you're the one To go telling me just where I'm coming from You can have my cake, don't frost me till I'm done no, I can't be fixed and I can't afford to stall Cause life ain't hard, it's just a waterfall hey, you and me, sometimes it happens We like to play the one-eyed fool you can act like we don't know what to do It's a sad eyed mask, it's never really true 
I saw you backstage at the hall Trembling before the curtain call Packing life ain't hard, it's just a waterfall And you feel it how it's all around you now And you feel it how it's coming at you now You're loving and you're feeling Maybe mixed up, maybe stealing A little time, I'm just amazed Somehow we keep dealing You and me, we spin, we drift We're daring to be free And in a mirror time, time that falls like a sneeze Just when you think it's all a dream Just when you painted every scene Ooh, and everything you are has already been Oh, just when you think you've seen it all Feel the boiling wind come screaming in a squall You find life ain't hard, it's just a waterfall Yeah, life ain't hard, it's a waterfall Hey, life ain't hard, it's a waterfall A Denise, Denise caught where I was screwing up on that, didn't you? <laughs> um, say hi to Sammy. Sammy, how are you doing, Sammy? And uh, Kevin McNamara, late to the party. Oh, Kevin, I got to get also. I'll do my Kevin McNamara songs now. Oh well, here let me get a get a Kevin song here. Corner of your eye. Corner of your eye. He's thinking ghetto of your eye. But he's thinking. He's thinking. Um, yep. Yep. I can do that, Kevin. I can do anything you want. Or, of course, your Idaho yodeling. And if you tire, Denise is Superman. Oh, I haven't done Superman. I will do that. Say hi to Sophie. Hey, Sophie. Sunny Sedona. Uh, jealous. Yeah, yeah, my God. I was just thinking the other day, I was reading a, reading a thing on how much money traveling nurses were making. I was thinking, you know. Hope she comes back to camp and takes us all out to dinner. <laughs> let me let me let me take my other guitar here for this one, Kevin. Much as I love this. Boom. This song's called uh, um, Winter in Caribou, or as, as uh, Kevin McMahon calls it, Corner of Your Eye. Um, I always laughed all the years um, Seth and I played together, you know. We always had different names for the songs. We'd choose some random line out of the song. Um, but this is a uh, Caribou Main. I know your name It's written there Well I wonder if you care A six pack of Narragansett beer Some camels and that brownie over there 
Every day I stop by like I Got some place I gotta go I'm buying things I don't really need I don't read the Boston Globe But I, I think that I I caught the corner of your eye But why, why can't I try Say the things I got inside Oh dear ooh, ooh, ooh. You know around here But in a, a quiet way How long you gonna stay your baby sleeps by the porno rack And your car's got Michigan plate Well, winter here's a lonely time Snow piles and everything a pain I blew the tranny on my pickup truck so I'm driving that rusted out fair lane And I, I think that I Caught the corner of your eye But why, why can't I try And say the things I got inside well, pretty soon she knew my name. She'd say, hey, Jano, how you been? I'd bring her toys that I whittled up To hang over our little baby friend I felt myself all changed up somehow And I worked like I never worked before Hey, dropping trees and bucking logs All the while thinking of that store And I, I think that I I caught the corner of your eye And I, I think that I I'll say the things I got inside It well, all ends up pretty much like you think it might I got all spiffed up and went over to the store Got there a little later than I usually do I've been home whittling up this little Canada goose, a little thing with wings that flap that we could hang over the baby's crib and look like it was flying. Anyways, I get there, and Frank's behind the counter reading one of them magazines. He looked at me and said, It's too bad about Carol. She's a real good gal. I told her not to worry none, that there's plenty of folks around here looking for work, but none quite like herself. Fact of the matter is, John, she was sitting around here waiting for you to show, but seeing as you were so late in coming, and 
with that fellow she was with kind of looked like he wanted to get going. She just wrote down this note and asked if I'd give it to you here. What's she saying in there, Jana? Not much, Frank. He says, uh, Dear Jano, thanks a lot for everything you've done for me this winter. I really do wish we could have gotten to know each other better, but life just takes quiet, crazy turns sometimes. Well, you never know. No address. Michigan somewhere, I guess. Well, I stuck my head in a field in the stream magazine, so Frank couldn't see me. But like all the folks around here, he knew. Just all seemed kind of weird. Frank behind the counter saying, Hey, Jano, check out this one over here. corner of her eye but I I didn't try <laughs> there you go a little that was one of the first songs I ever heard heard um, on the radio some DJ from Boston was playing it, and after I was all excited, I'm like, oh, there's my song, you know, it's going to be famous, and, uh, um, <laughs> and he goes, hey, how about a little Prozac after that one, I was like, oh, shit, you know, but then he said, oh, what was your word you used to say, my songs aren't sad, they're, no, I said there's a difference between sad and depressing, oh, okay, yes, so depressing or sad, yes, it's not supposed to be a depressing song, it's supposed to, Supposed to be sad. I mean, I'm one of those white blues, you know, white suburban blues singers, you know. Since I'm in this key, Kevin, I'm gonna do this one here. So I always wanted to write a motorcycle song. Uncle Jerry, cousin Jerry, <laughs> Denise always corrects me. Um. Let me sit on as Indian a couple years ago, and then I, I, uh, I imagined myself, you know, as some guy just wanting to say screw everything, you know. So it's a song called "The Rogue." Kicked up my Indian, I started out to ride. Finally listened to the voice I had inside. Then I told my old boss he could just go to hell. Been there myself and I knew it all too well Well I rode through the days and I rode through the nights Hell I'd ride anywhere if the feeling it was right Well I gave up on thinking my life had any plan And dreams are chains I cannot understand I'm a road Just a road on the road. I helped a trucker near Reno get his rig out of a ditch, and he gave me twenty dollars, and he just told me life's a bitch. And when he rode away, he gave me three blasts of his horn. It's the sweetest song I ever heard Since the day that I was born Then I slept in a graveyard In three-way Tennessee With a gal that I met down Boca Chica Key And she held my hand and told me There ain't no love that lasts But living alone Is just a pain in the ass Hey, they rose
I've been from bird's eye to baby town Toad sucked to possum trot Lost a girl in Brainy Burrow I lost the cops in Kitty Hall I lost a wheel in Istribula Lost a fight in Bowling Green Caught a mess of trout in Ten Sleep Sang a song in Aberdeen I know the crack and sound of coal cars From the sounds of hot shot trains And the smell of grass in Illinois It ain't the same in western Maine And the taste of dust in Arkansas Ain't the same in Idaho I close my eyes, feel the curves, let my Indian go I'm a road, just a road on the road They're 40 miles outside of some old Wyoming town My Indian blew a gasket and my iron horse went down Well I dropped her down beside the road and started out to hitch That trucker was right, life is just a bitch But I'm happy enough out here traveling alone Well I got the whole damn country and every road to call my own well, I'm dirty and I'm poor, but let it just be said That freedom is better than any feather bed And I'm a road, just a road I'm a road, just a road Sorry about that, Chris. Chris is one of the dynamic men of the world. It's an old Danny O'Keefe song. I don't know if Seth's still on, but uh. We used to, Seth and I used to play a lot on Sunday nights at the inn. Those were kind of fun nights. Um, that's basically when I met, uh, met Chris's parents. Ron and Judy really, really love this song. I will dedicate this to Chris's friend, Charlie. Everybody's gone away. They say they're moving to LA. They say this town will waste your time. Yes, they're right, wasting mine. Some call a freight, some call a play. Find the sunshine, leave the rain. I'd love to try and settle down, but everybody's leaving town. Some gotta win, some gotta lose. A good time, Charlie's got the blues. You know my heart keeps telling me 
You're not a kid at 33 Play around to lose your wife You played along, you lose your life I got some pills to ease the pain I find the sunshine, leave the rain I'd love to try and settle down But everybody's leaving town Some gotta win, some gotta lose A good time, Charlie Got the blues Some gotta win Some gotta lose A Good time Charlie's got the blues Charlie. Um, usually Seth has the coolest little ending to that song. It's sort of a, he does very, very funky things. Charlie Sol Solari. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. we, Solari. No, not Solari. Solari. Oh, Solari, okay. Yeah. We get some. Ooh, I've never sang so many of my own songs in a row without a, without a, uh, that was a, <laughs> a good break. Another sad one, is that what we call that song? Sad but not depressing. Um, well, the Kevin Mack's still on. Um, first met Kevin probably 30 years ago. Him and his wife Laura came down, I think before they even had kids. They'd come down to the Colonial Inn. And I could never tell if they were just being gracious. But I remember I sang this song about their, their big, big hunting and fishing family. And, um, they love their they love their their woods and fields and the yeah. I wrote this song a long time ago. It's called Musketaquid, which uh, somebody told me was the original Native American name for the uh, for the Concord River. Somebody told me it meant slow moving river. That sounded pretty good because it's a pretty damn slow moving river. Later on, I found out that it means grass-grown river, but I guess it don't. It doesn't matter. But any rate, I spent a lot of my childhood in, on, and around the uh, Concord River, and Sudbury River, and Assabet River. Even now, we live pretty damn close to the Assabet River. Get a little too big on rambling. Say the cattails too big for their own. Yeah, my skeddock with gold moon hang. You gotta ramble through my home. Yeah, my skeddock with slow moving river. You gotta ramble through my home. Well, the snow melt will melt out, snow melt will grind out my great meadows. Wild geese made up after fires. Well, snappers out crossing the road. Sound like bottles banged at night. Yeah, snappers out crossing the road. Sound like bottles banged at night. We hear them all talk about the places where the river ran fastest and clear. At the Assabet Fork by the boulder where the kid could find last year. 
that the ass had been forked by the boulder where the kid could find last year. You just gotta. <laughs> this verse was for Muskie, my old buddy, who was still doing traps till in the 80s. I used to go out with him sometimes. So got a few guys sitting trap lines. Muskrats far from all gone. They'll canoe spring all the traps while they're paddling along. Here yeah, canoers spring all their traps as they paddle it along. Black families from Boston come fishing, but they pretty much keep from the town. And the farmers still plowing up arrowhead, some nipmuck left around. Here yeah, farmers still plowing up arrowheads, some nipmuck left around. Well, the state paid to replank the bridge For the folks to keep all coming by They blow rags out the armory cannon They fall down and fake their dying Blow rags out the armory cannon Fall down and fake their dying Well, it all gets real frozen come winter the cattails stick up through the snow Mosquito quit cold moon hanging You gotta ramble through my home Well, mosquito quit cold moon hanging You gotta ramble through my home Trap line when she was a little girl. Oh, yeah, I bet. Still wears pearls when catching frogs. <laughs> I, I would love a picture of that. I can, I can imagine you out there with your, your dad. That song was a big hit. Oh, good. Melinda Bird liked it. Mm -hmm. What's that song I like? Calvary. Oh, Calvary, Meeting Jesus by the River? Yes. I can do that. Let me see if I remember it. Um, It is funny, I mean, my whole life really has been, you know, I was little, we were right near Great Meadows in the Concord River, and then I moved to the White Pond side of town, and so we were close to the, the Sudbury River. Now we're close to the Assabet. But uh, I was always a, a, what do they call it, a, a doubting Thomas of a religious person. But I was always obsessed and still am, you know, with uh, meeting Jesus by the river. So I wrote the song about meeting Jesus by the river. It would have died a, died an, an early and ignominious death, but then when Denise one day said she liked it, and that's all I needed to hear. It seemed like it ain't been a long time <laughs> I think I, I got this song right here, Denise. Can you believe that? I rarely look down at, at a song to read the lyrics, you know, but... It seems like it ain't been a long time but I'm damn pleased you're coming by again It's been a while since you sit down and ramble About this and that, why and who and then You said that you had to get a move on Move on and leave a space behind So I spent a while hitting all your old roads Old friends and kicking down the wine But sure enough got sick of all the rambling Same stories and the way folks just are 
Well, who believe a hobo and a rucksack? And who believe I really come that far? You know, pan and bread don't give you much to walk on. And ain't so free, I don't want nothing more. And it ain't so hard to say what I believe in. But what's the sense to beg it door to door? So I settle down right here by the oxbow. I catch cabers off the bank that's caving in. Well, I sure hope you brung along your old lines. We'll chuck them out and catch a string again. Yeah, I settle down right here by the oxbow. Catch cabers off the bank that's caving in. Sure hope you brung along your old lines We'll chuck them out and catch a string again Hmm, thanks. Um, Jack McGuire just walked to Egg Rock. Oh really? Isn't that, it's a great little walk. It's like the straightest trail on the planet. Um, that was uh, the local writer John Mitchell who wrote a book called Ceremonial Time, something like that. Really, really cool book. But it talks about Egg Rock as being like the uh, the spiritual meeting ground of a, a lot of the native tribes. Done a lot of songs. What time is it now? 46. Oh, really? Jiminy Crow. You only have 15 minutes more of my, my horrible songs. Let me see. Oh, Superman. Here we go. The song Denise wrote. Um, Charlie was in the hospital when he was, how old was he, like four or five? Four. Four. Sorry. I get afraid that, that Seth is listening, you know, and <laughs> the guitar's out of tune. Let me just tune it here. There you go, Seth. Hope it's all right. Um, but... Um, he went in for some tonsil surgery or something like that, and it's got a little more complicated and scary. And uh, but being in children's hospital, you know, for extended periods is pretty, pretty, uh, pretty, pretty humbling. So uh, Denise always told me I should write a song about it, and I never did, and I never did, and finally one day she wrote it. Damn it if it's not the, uh, probably the, probably the song that gets requested the most. Even up at summer camp, it's, it's the, uh, it's really cool to sing this song around the campfire with 200 kids singing along with you. But Charlie always, always, always wore his Superman outfit probably every day for when he was little. There's a little blonde boy in a Superman cape Racing around the backyard Saying, Daddy, don't you know I can fly to the stars Gonna bring you back some stars Don't you know that I can't get hurt Cause I'm Superman today Let's 
scoop that boy right into my arms This is what I say You don't need a cape to be a hero Cause you got all the special powers that you need And your smile's enough to save the world from evil Yeah, you'll always be Superman to me That little blonde boy in the cape again Says he's gonna jump off the deck I say, little man, can't you just slow down? One day you're gonna break your neck But don't you know that I can't get hurt Cause I'm Superman today I scoop that boy right into my arms This is what I say You don't need a cape to be a hero Cause you got all the special powers that you need And your smile's enough to save the world from evil And you'll always be Superman to me One day he woke up and didn't want his cape We knew that something ain't right And the doctor said, well, we just don't know We better keep him the night Combed his hair and I held his hand And somehow he fell off to sleep Knelt at the window and I prayed to the stars God help me leap But I've never been much of a praying man I never had a faith very clear But give me a sign and I'll step in the line Get my boy out of here And I'll give you everything And a man's ever got Give you every bit of my love a whisper came back to me A prayer from above Saying you don't need a cape To be his hero Cause you got all the special powers that you need And your smile's enough to save the world from evil And you'll always be Superman to me There's a little boy woke up in a hospital room Looking so quiet and sad Bring him in his cape and I say, big man, how about a smile for dad? And his wide blue eyes filled up with tears. I'm not Superman today. I scoop that boy right into my arms. This is what I say. You don't need a cape to be my hero. Cause you got all the special powers that you need. And your smile's enough to save the world from evil But you'll always be Superman to me Yeah, you'll always be Superman to me No, oh, I... No, but and, uh, it is, it's crazy sometimes when you sing it. And uh, the song's got certain certain power. I mean, it really, uh, really, really hits those chords, I guess. Pardon the, pardon the pun, you know. Um, there was a song I was singing the other night. And, Denise thought I was singing a John Prine song, and uh, in a way, I, in a way, I was. You know, I just wrote this song down on a, as a stupid, funny song. I was stealing. I was doing a little bit of stealing. I stole the uh, basic tune of the song from a John Prine song, and I, I sang. I stole the twist at the end from a, a, a song my daughter Kaylee wrote, which is a. What's the name of that song? 
man. You're no man, yeah. I'd love, we gotta get Kaylee to record it sometime. It's really, really fun, poignant, and very funny. This is gone, go, no worries. Let me see, I forget what it's on. I got a sign out on my front porch I got lies to sell today You know I once was a collector Now they just get in the way I thought our love would last forever and I thought you'd always be mine Now you think that you know better So I'll just step out of the line Cause I woke up today And I, I thought some more And it ain't you I'm living for Hey, no worries it don't matter anymore Well, you were my first and my last girlfriend At our first kiss playing spoon We danced all night to Led Zeppelin Beneath the ring around the moon Time has a way of taking over Yesterday's remember time Well, I still got that four-leaf clover But I don't believe in signs Cause I woke up today and I, I thought some more and it ain't you I'm living for No worries It don't matter anymore I guess you'll probably want this old house And most of everything inside At first I was mad as all get out but that was just my wounded pride Well, over there are Grandma's bookends And there's the crib we put the boys in Over there's a glass of poison I just gave some to your boyfriend Cause I woke up today and I thought some more And it ain't you I'm living for Hey, don't worry It don't matter anymore My murder ballad Oh, Jiminy. Ooh, what would I do for a last song for... I'll do the first song on... Uh... Have you been plugging my books and all those things? <laughs> No, you don't have to. Well, you can. But if anybody wants to buy a book of my songs, pretty good sized book, actually. Um, <laughs> not that it's a good book, uh, but you can get it on, on Amazon. And all my other books, my poetry books, and uh, my book of essays. Been a busy bee during these, this... Uh, um, what? Pandemic. Pandemic. <laughs> Thank you. This is a song called Don't Let Go, You're So Off. Stick with my semi-religious theme there for the evening here. Um, 
I wrote this when I was living in Taiwan, and I was just absolutely, absolutely, totally dead broke, sick. I just got semi-electrocuted in my horrible little tenement room. So I dragged myself out and sat down and wrote this song. Kind of got me through. Sometimes, yeah. Sometimes, no. And sometimes it's somehow, somewhere in between. Sometimes it's somewhere that nobody's ever been. Nobody knows where nothing can end. Don't let go, hope you find it again. Don't you ever let go? Don't you ever let go of your soul? Don't you ever let go of your soul? Things got ways living by unless you hold Don't you ever let go Don't you ever let go Sometimes, man, I wish they put snakes in the trees And it'd just be this big space between them and me Say, no way, Jose, hey, that ain't how I'll be Beat him the wrong lot to be free Don't you ever let go And it's working the strings of the prophets and clown You're hung and you're brung and you're strung and worn down If it's man, don't worry, here's what we found Face got a chance when your soul's out of town Don't you ever let go of your soul don't you ever let go of your soul The things that got wasted by unless you hold Don't you ever let go No, you cannot, you should not, you will not, you know You cannot ever let go of your soul Don't you ever let go for hanging out with me sorry for messing up the things i messed up and uh, thanks for indulging my my night of night of my own songs here and uh well hopefully it's snowing pretty soon and i'll be out on the roads all night long and i'll think about you all right thanks <laughs>